ladies and gentlemen and welcome back to the Grand I Am YouTube channel. Now, I just want to put this video out there to help out uh, anyone who just wants to get started and maybe kind of on a budget for like making YouTube content and like editing down streams and different and different things of that such. These are some helpful resources that I've used uh, and most of them I currently still use. So this is just going to be me kind of going over some free programs, some things you could take advantage of if you're starting out. Um, I'm going to go off the basis that you already have a uh, laptop or desktop you have access to like webcam if you ch so choose and a microphone uh, i'm just gonna go off the base of that say you got like some cheap usb mic or you and you you've, you've got a computer so with internet access that usually helps and you're running on windows i, I guess that's another thing i can't uh, uh help you with but a lot of these should work on mac i don't know anything about linux so uh good luck in that department but i'm gonna kind of go over some resources that you can take advantage of some different things uh some of this would also be helpful for like uh streaming if you want to get into streaming um I can't exactly go over and help you with like setting it up, but I wanted to just give you point you in the direction of some resources that you can take advantage of uh uh so first up we have obs everyone should pretty much know this resource if they're into any kind of content creation uh that re that are like gaming especially we have open broadcasting software it's completely free to use you can get it on steam i prefer downloading it separately and in fact this is mostly for like if you're doing an obs recording or like just doing recording not really streaming you can stream from it if you want to do like more recording stuff or like some like studio stuff with like multicam and like that kind of thing this is kind of more base like that it's kind of like the baseline now we're gonna move over to stream elements which is what i use to stream this is how i get my chat up this is how i have all my notice for sub and different things like that stream elements is what you want to do and right here is downloading the se version of obs it is basically a add-on to obs that adds in a bunch of their stuff so you can do it right in the obs application right off the bat super simple it's not i mean super simple but it's free to use and it has a bunch of different stuff in there you can also set up merch through them if you want to speaking of merchandise you can purchase my merchandise in the link in the description below we got bosh baking merchandise we got merchandise for the penny pincher and we also got a yappy t-shirt commemorating our many of times we've speed run and bingo to super mario odyssey and yappy just always gets in the way back to you helpful david now i have to deal with like setting up through a third-party company it's all through there it's easy they're pretty good stuff i use the desk pad i have an apron i have a sweatshirt the sweatshirt blanks are really nice printing printing's all right i've seen worse printing for stuff and honestly everything's pretty reasonably cheap um the only thing i will say is for t-shirts get the next size above uh what your current size is that's the only thing i really have to note um for that really you know they handle it all of in you take your cut they take their cut of it and you can just kind of like deposit it uh withdraw it through them super easy all right so now you got obs set up you can start live streaming and recording the next thing you're gonna need to is to be able to cut them down and i really recommend davinci resolve now let me let me come up here for davinci resolve here davinci resolve you're gonna want this because one it is completely free everything you want you could possibly want to do you could pretty much do it for free in davinci resolve there's some like effects and things like that you don't really need for like editing down gameplays or like irl videos there's some like wacky like like green screen ish kind of effects i use this for a good year or so the reason i really honestly to be completely honest the reason i just don't use davinci resolve as compared to vegas is because i learned on Vegas 14 and then I learned on 17 and I I currently have 19 it's just I learned how to make stuff on that and I feel like I'm better with that one and I have just all the stuff accessible but with DaVinci Resolve you get it uh free updates forever you can use it forever and you don't have to worry about it and if you purchase it i think for 250 dollars you get access to everything and free update forever to my understanding do not quote me on that davinci resolve it is a great resource for you all right now over to you need to make some thumbnails you need to make a profile picture for yourself i'm gonna recommend that you get over into GIMP, global image manipulation program this is what i use for every thumbnail probably i i know 
oh, pretty much every single thumbnail and just some other stuff. Um, backgrounds, I've made a bunch of things with background. It is an open source software, yet again. It is free, it is great. I, I like it. It has a bunch of stuff you can use for plugins. It's completely free and it doesn't support Adobe. Um, the next thing I want to show you is a little trick that uh, Warehouse Goblins didn't know. And I thought everyone knew this. You're on the channel page, so you need to edit a description for something. I don't know. You want to add your friend's link into the description or you want to change something. So you can go here, you can click video, you can click this, then you hit select all. This will allow you to edit whatever here and every single YouTube video. Shorts, I don't believe you can do the same thing with. You can. Live streams, you cannot. You have to do them at whatever channel page you have at a time. So be wary with that. That is something you could do. That's a little trick I have. You can, you have everything set up. You're about, you're ready. To, you got all your stuff set up on your computer. You got the editing software you set up and the way you, you want it. You learned a little thing or two, which it's easy to just kind of get the basics down. Then you kind of just Google things as you go along. That is how I learn in the stuff I've done the same with GIMP and OBS and you just kind of Google things and just keep researching but so you got your PC set up you got everything set up you're ready to stream but what what are you going to stream well I want to tell you about one thing here let me go back to PC game boom epic games every week they do a free game giveaway this week is cat quest 2 and orcs must die once you claim this game it is in your library forever you just have to click this and you just have to go in and click claim and you're done i have gotten so many games from them for free this one free i i bought this one free i brought this one with the coupon free i bought this one outright uh coupon i paid for this one I paid for this one free, free. I think I paid for this one free, 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 free. No, I did not get. I, I actually, I pay. I paid for Alan Wake. Free, 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 free. I'm just gonna scroll through, and if I don't point it out, I got it for free. Let me look through here. We're, we're keep scrolling. All right, I got Dishonored two. I paid for that one. The other two completely free. Mm-hmm. Yep, still scrolling. I paid for this one. Uh I I bought that one. Uh for multiplayer for on my other laptop. Um let's see. Yep, still free. Completely free. No moolah spent so far. Uh-huh. Free, free, free. Uh-huh. Yep. Still free. Everything you're seeing, you get, you, you could have gotten for free. Yeah, I don't think I'm seeing anything. Nope. I did, but I bought Tales from the Borderlands, I believe. Yes. I bought it on sale. Yep. Everything so far has been free that I have not mentioned. Yep. I was editing the video and realized that I forgot to mention I did pay for new tales from the borderlands so everything else though that I did not mention is free now how it works is once a week you have to go in it's Thursday at 11 a.m. they change the game that is free you have for for example till May 9th at 11 a.m. Then it goes over to Firestone with, I think it's a free game with in-game bonuses. And Circus Electric, Electric. They're free. Once you claim them, they are yours forever. So if you want content, you want games for free to stream, this is going to be your favorite thing. And there's always like the free like Fortnite and there's Rocket Leagues and stuff like that. If you want some like good single player games, you can get them for free. I love Orcs Must Die. In fact, I had Orcs Must Die before this. I claimed it because it's free. If something ever happens with my Steam account, I got that game. But there, that is an excellent resource um, for free games to stream. And once you, you, you don't have to have them downloaded. You just have to claim them and they're in your library on steam forever and they're just yours um like i said you, i got dying light i got all the bioshocks they're great games that i plan on trying to go through eventually but it's a free resource you get free games and if you have a computer and your computer can play that and dream them you have 
a plethora of content. In fact, you probably wouldn't need to buy a game. Yeah, I I, I think this is the, I hope this resource kind of guide has been helpful. The only thing I want to add is let me Google something and see if you're looking to be a console gamer and you are looking for a capture card cheap this is my recommendation for said capture card i recommend this capture card as you can tell, see it has purchased three times uh because i have friends that are streamers and i i've gotten one for myself i got one for my friend for christmas then i got another one for a friend so they can stream uh ember i got one for ember so she could stream console game it is i personally have never had an issue with this one uh, it's metal. It's pretty durable. It's pretty simple. I uh, hope you guys had gotten some good information out of this video. Um, some little tips and tricks and resources. If you're a up and coming content creator. Well, well, ladies and gentlemen, I hope you liked this video and found something useful. If you did, give this video a like. If you like the channel, you can subscribe and turn on notification bells to be notified of all further uploads. And if you really want to help me out, click cards in the video to take you more content. And with that, I'll adieu. Adios.